No, I don't think so at all. I mean, uh, I know I said early, and I still believe it was the easiest transition I could have imagined. And uh, I think we picked up on it well. We just haven't been able to execute it as well as you need to against other defenses. Well, yeah, a lot of a lot of that's just experience. There's still a lot of guys who um, are playing their first couple football games, and they're only going to get better. We got to have the experienced guys making sure we're leading and uh, getting this offense turned around. Absolutely, you still got to. I mean, take what they give you. You can't start forcing stuff. Um, it, it's going to come if you keep doing your job. You just got to keep hammering away and uh, make sure all eleven guys are on the same page. I mean, because it's how it's got to be. That's how it is. Offensive football, I mean, it kind of, I'm the guy throwing the ball around. I'm the one getting us in and out of plays, and uh, I got to do a better job. We've got, we got to be able to, to get the ball down the field and get the ball into the end zone when we get those, those few opportunities in the red zone. Well, if you snap, then you're done for. The whole the whole <laughs> yeah, battle is not snapping. Like it's seven, trying to stay in that happy medium of forward, throw a touchdown, it's yeah, whatever. It's, if you throw a pick, uh, it's whatever. Yeah, kind of to stay an even keel. If you start worrying about that, uh, it's only going to hurt you. You really got to try to take care of your job. And what happens besides you is what happens. Drops are going to happen. They happen in practice. Okay. Picks are going to happen. They happen in practice. It's all stuff that, that happens. And... Uh, emotions or anything like that is only going to make you not play maybe to your, to your ability and uh, I know I learned a lot of that from Rick I, I take a lot of that from Coach Ferentz it's just a it's a mild approach it's, it's never too high never too low and drops are drops they happen you got to move on James I don't know if it's just having to go out there and do it, um, getting that confidence that we can do it. Um, you know, doing it in practice is one thing, and a game is a whole other situation. There's a whole other set of nerves and uh, pressure you're dealing with. So, uh, yeah, I think we got to get guys to loosen up a little bit and go out there and just have a little bit more fun. And, uh, you know, we're all out here to have fun. You know, it's not, it doesn't have to be life or death. So, uh, maybe we just need to get back to the basics of enjoying what we're doing. You go back to, you know, 1999, it's going to come down to breaking the rock. We need to keep taking swings at it and know that eventually it will break. And it's, uh, you know, it's not going to be one swing that does it. It's going to be, the, you know, the multiple, uh, you know, takes at it. Uh, I think up front they're very aggressive. Uh, they're very good offensive line, I, in my opinion. You know, and uh, and we'll we'll continue to watch the tape here throughout the uh, throughout the week. But I, I think that uh, I really respect the way they come off the ball, and and the, the, you know they're really trying to move guys up front. And um, I think yeah, they watching the Wisconsin game. They did you know they gave them all they could handle, and it was a really tight game down there till the end. And um, we're definitely expecting them to come in here and, and play. You know, and uh, and we got to go out there and uh, have a great defensive performance to. Uh, uh, you know, to match that. Um, you know, it keeps guys fresher and uh, you have a little bit more, uh, have your legs under you a little bit more as the game goes on, which is always uh, always a little bit nicer. And, uh, you know, we talk about it as a defensive front that has to be an advantage for us because most offensive lines we play do not rotate and uh, we're rotating guys through. And, and with that, Coach expects you, I mean, you better be humming to the football every play. Um, it hasn't opened my eyes at all. You know, I was just watching the game. We watched a little bit on Sunday. And, you know, they just played good from their defense. And, you know, Wisconsin couldn't really push it as much as they wanted to. But, you know, they had a couple of mishaps. And if they executed on what they were supposed to, they might have had more. So, I mean, it's not opening my eyes or anything. I'm just going to try to go and do what we can do. And, you know, we're not comparing ourselves to anybody else. <laughs> I don't know about surprise. Like that's it's a goal that I was to be. You just work. You can, all you can do is work as hard as you can. Do. All you can do is care about your the controllables. What you control, what I control, is just how I practice out there, my demeanor out there, like, and that's that's all I can control, and that's that's what I did. That's that when something it's, like it's that. It's hard happens. to let it go, but you have to let it go. You just have, it's just gotta. I just want to be. In, I just want to prove from that. Like it's it's hard to let go, obviously, but. We're moved on right now. I got to move on from then. Just continue to improve each and every day.